It's not often Australia makes its mark on the international handball scene, but that's just what a group of amateurs based at Sydney University will be hoping to do this weekend. They'll compete against the might of big budget European teams at the Club World Championship in Qatar. And with the assistance of a star Brazilian recruit, the Australian side is confident of causing an upset or two. His palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. There's vomit on his sweater already. Mom's spaghetti, he's nervous, but on the surface he looks calm and ready. It's fast, physical and ferocious. And while it's huge in Europe and boasts more than 31 million registered players around the world, handball rarely steals the headlines down under. Handball's a full contact sport. I mean, as you can see behind us, there's a, a fair bit of contact going on. And it's, uh, yeah, it's a really physical game. So you're always in contact with other players. Um, you've got a guy on the opposing team whose job is to literally run into you. So I think it surprises people when they see the sport for the first time. Uh, they go, wow, you can really hit, you can really foul and, you know, uh, draw some blood type thing. With a burgeoning international reputation and a host of professional and semi-professional players from overseas, the Sydney University side is looking to change that. They hope. The, the children get uh, excited about this sport and oh, can say, oh, mom, I want to practice it. It's really nice and it's physical and I have a lot of fun. So that's that's the way I start. So I hope we can do this this kind of thing here in Australia too. With two Olympic Games and seven World Championships under his belt, Renato Tupan Roy has brought international notoriety to the side. I didn't expect that. But it turns like uh, a dream then come true. I played, I played and I lived uh, in Germany. That is the, the best league in the world. And uh, I play also in Italy. So through sport, I get, uh, I get some opportunities in my life and I, I really enjoy it. Tim Anderson is one of only a couple of born and bred Aussies in the team. It's pretty incredible talking about what I do. I mean, just this year I've gone to Kosovo, Germany, we're going to Qatar on Saturday and, um, and you know, you get to do some incredible things, see some incredible places um, and travelling with a team is just the best. As the only amateur side at the World Champs, the underdogs surprised a couple of their more fancied opponents last year and the Oceania champs are confident they can cause an upset this time around. Reversing the team that won basically the best competition in Europe, um, a team that was the runner-up as well. So reversing teams that are really high quality. Um, and for us, it's a chance to show the handball world, I think the wider handball world, that we can come and compete at this level. Neve Owens, ABC Grandstand. And that's all from Grandstand for now. You can always catch up on the program.